Hello everybody, how you doing? Welcome to the channel of the Loquacious One. Thank you for tuning in. I am glad you decided to click my channel to see what Loquacious One is all about. Loquacious means talkative one. And I'm coming at you today with a haul on how to build an affordable breakfast bar. Everything with the exception of the appliances came from the Dollar Tree and of course the fruit. But I'm going to show you how to do it the loquacious one way so we won't have a excuse not to be motivated or to be able to get that jump start on our our journey on better health and a better weight without using the excuse well i just don't have and da 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 i'm trying to eliminate that we're going to work together folks all righty thank you for my returning viewers i love you all you know you're great and you're awesome Mwah. so let's get started uh one of the things i used to decorate this area is this little chalk board sign and it's a uh, heart shape with red glitter it's just simply gorgeous and i light under the cabinet with these little lights that you get from the dollar tree and they're just simply gorgeous for spotlighting areas uh i don't use this in this area but just to show you some of the cute things that dollar tree have i found these mirror stickers heart shaped stickers they are so cute and they're in pink and purple and also they have this campbell soap soup bowl cozy so if your bowl is hot uh you can carry it from the microwave to the table with this cozy it's cute get you a couple because you know you're not going to use it for like a formal dinner or anything but just something to have i think it's cute i like doing tablescapes all right another thing they have for decorating is this ha uh they have mugs and coffee cups and all that but i love this big mug it's this happy valentine's day isn't it gorgeous as well as that little uh heart shape uh sign that's lighted with batteries so I've just put the cup in there and I just keep this little cup for spoons napkins and bags that of course I get from the Dollar Tree that's a candle I had it's ratchet forgive it because I burn my candles every day and I got water I get this for the store Pellegrino Perrier I like Voss I just love water because I had to give up soda soda is so bad for you I started getting just gastritis from it it was just killing me I also was drinking coffee but you should not drink coffee on an empty stomach and limit it maybe to one cup a day if you're able to take that but I just decided to do without it for a minute and I'm going with tea two of the appliances that I got that I love I love my and this is, if you can see it, my Hamilton Beach uh, tea kettle. It's electric. And I got this for $13 at a clearance on, at Big Lots for $13. Bucks. Love it to death. And it comes off the base, and I can carry it to the table wherever I need to carry it. The next thing I got was this oyster. Um, and you might have seen this in the haul. This is a personal blender, which I blend my smoothies because mainly that's all the time I have is to do a smoothie. And what I like about this is that when you take it off the base this is the blending mechanism right here but you can replace that blending mechanism with this on the go top this lid so you don't even have to worry about pouring it and cleanup is easy because you just have one cleanup I also have two juicers they're in another part of the house I don't have room for them I use them somewhere else but juicers are good to have but I generally juice later on in the day after I come from work because I just don't feel like it in the morning to be honest and I like my um, juices fresh um, also I got fruit fruit is so great check out fruit get you a basket a really pretty basket or container and display your fruit so you're more apt to grab it you know uh, I just eat in season fruit because it's more affordable you know it's a quick grab and go also in these little this is a Christmas pattern, but I'm just trying to get rid of them. I put my nuts in here to go or what have you. So I, I'll, I won't have no excuse for not eating healthy. And these are something just to show you if you work out their game up, sports shoes. I don't know if they still have them, but I got them in Power Punch and Orange Lift. And they, the little bag looks, looks like this. And they taste like little candy. They're actually good. And I eat them after I work out. It says it has 125 milligrams of electrolytes. It's an extra source of excellent source of energy, releasing B vitamins, an excellent source of vitamin C. And it's eight one ounce packets, and it keeps me from craving something sweet. So, um, yeah, these were dollar at Dollar Tree. And also, these Libby Crush pineapples. I get pineapples because pineapples are good to uh, put in your smoothies and drinks. Also, they have uh, coconut milk. They have coconut juice 
as well as coconut water. This is a good refreshing drink to drink during your workouts or afterwards if you do not, and I'm making this disclaimer, have any health challenges. Watch this stuff, especially if you're diabetic, hypoglycemic, or whatever. Watch your sugar intake, or if you have anything where sugar, diabetes, and sugar is a problem, please consult your doctor or dietitian. Okay, do not just take this stuff haphazardly, thinking it's all right because someone else does. Okay, another thing on the grab and go. Uh, Dollar Tree, if you can find them, sometimes they have these little on-the-go cereal packs. And I got the uh, Special K Original, as well as the granola with cranberry. And they had some Kellogg's Frosted Flake Energy Clusters. They had several. I just picked up what I thought I like. You might like something else. And I also grabbed the Kellogg's Special K Pastry Crisp and Blueberry. And Caramel Coconut and strawberry also i got the special k protein trail mix and i love these these was in fruit and nuts and i stacked up on these because these are my favorite kellogg nutrigrain fruit and nuts i got one two three four five of those so i should be well to do and getting back to what i was telling you about i had to replace my coffee my my drinks with water uh, I drink tea now, like green tea. I got oolong tea, uh, just tons of teas. And I keep them in these containers, of course, from Dollar Tree, and they go inside the cabinet. And these are the teas that I generally get from the Dollar Tree. You know, I have tons of teas, but these I'm showing you because they come from the Dollar Tree. Apple cranberry, blueberry, chai, camelite. Uh, this jasmine didn't come from there. Uh, lemon and mint, peach passion, peppermint, another peppermint, and assorted teas. Um, also, I have some cinnamon stick that came from Dollar Tree. And I have a little sh uh, shakers. The salt and pepper shakers that you get at Dollar Tree are really good for putting your cinnamons and your nutmegs and your ginger, whatever spice you want to add. I also use those. They're from the Dollar Tree. They're on the camera. I do not feel like getting them now. But... This should pretty much wrap up how I do it. I grab my little milk. If you drink milk, I drink almond milk myself uh, and cashew milk. Uh, I don't do soy, but if that's your choice, that's your choice. I do drink sometimes organic uh, whole milk. And I drink, uh, of course, I, like I said, I juice. So sometimes I can't. I have to not lie. I buy apple juice or whatever but i moderate it because that is full of sugar the sugars i use are zolotol i use a stevia you can get stevia from the dollar tree um and i use some uh organic honey okay i, I don't use the one from the dollar tree because i don't think they carry real honey but i'm not for sure it might be a blend or something so you have to check they also have spices you can use at the dollar tree cinnamon nutmeg i use organic spices but they it's perfectly all right but they have uh, cinnamon nutmeg ginger what have you so you're going to add that to it i do not eat bread i'm not a real bread bread person per se the only thing i do is grab these protein bars and grab my cereal and my teas, I get a piece of fruit, and I am good to go. Make my smoothie, drink. I, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I'm, 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 I'm better. I'm at a better place than I was. All right, folks, that's it. That's all for my little how to build your own little breakfast bar. I'm gonna come at you next time with how to do a coffee bar. All right, folks, love you all. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. Turn on your notifications so you can be regularly notified. It's a little bell emblem, I believe. Don't forget to share this if you're on social media with anybody who you think might enjoy it. Sharing is caring. If you're on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, share. Also, if you have any questions, cares, concerns, comments, or constructive criticism, leave them in the box below. As always, I'm out of here. Love you to death. And here's to better health. Bye-bye.